Design Village is situated at the end of first year and in this year's case at the end of second year to give students an idea of what the design build experience could and possibly should look like. Those foundational years are really significant for a student taking risk in a process and they're more apt to learn from that risk taking as opposed to a higher level student who has already been down that path. There's just so much hands-on learning that comes to this competition. Students learn how to work in the college's support shop, which has done an amazing job of dealing with the influx of students this past quarter. They learn how to find materials, how to work with materials, how to work with the team. Through the short time frame, they're able to unlock a lot of skill sets and intuitions that they probably didn't realize that they actually had. And so the mechanism of Learn by Doing is, is actually something that is brought out and brought to the forefront. It's great to see each team build a structure out of pure creativity. It's a great way to kind of explore my passion for building things and figuring out how things connect. It's really interesting to see how many different ideas people have. Yeah, I really love it. It's fun. Just the amount that we like learn from each other and from the experience, it's just I'm going to take this experience with me for the rest of my life. We want students to remember the design build process as something creative an experience that's supposed to be fun and team-oriented and something that they put a part of themselves into and then get a part of themselves back out of. And so Design Village really aims to try to keep that spirit alive with them throughout the next five years and say, this is what it's supposed to be like, this is what it can be like.